As some of you know, there have been a couple of attempts to bring a Stretch Armstrong movie to the big screen in recent years. Both attempts have failed, but now a video has leaked from the Universal Pictures attempt of developing the movie showing some storyboard animatics, giving us a taste of what the movie might have been. Take a look. Well, my Stretch Armstrong toy as a kid was not that badass. Erin, <laughs> buy or sell the looks of Universal Stretch Armstrong. I'm going to buy this so hard a million times over because you know what this looks like? This looks like the Plastic Man origin story that I've been dying <laughs> to see. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> and this is just proof that it's entertaining and stretchy powers can be fun and that might actually work in a movie. So even though it sounds like this project is dead, it gives me hope that maybe one day, somewhere in the DC Universe, I will get my Plastic Man movie <laughs> on the big screen. So I'm going to buy this. It looks pretty cool. You mm -hmm. should take your stretch and be happy with it. <laughs> she said stretchy strength is cool. <laughs> It's a power, guys. Oh, I love it. Anyway, um, yeah, I, I am going to hesitantly buy this. When I first started watching it, I was like, wait, what am I watching? It felt like anime Matrix with like so many other yeah, things mixed yeah. in. And then I kept watching, and honestly, right when it started getting kind of gory is when I was like, I kind of like this. And they were jumping around, and like it definitely, I think it could be kind of a cool premise. And I know this is just the storyboard, um, but yeah, I, I can't say I would not watch this. I would. You know, um, th that clip is just like a minute and a half of a five-minute five clip. Minutes. Yeah. And we, by the way, you can look in the um, in the description of this video, and we got a link so you can watch the full five minute clip. But this is back when Taylor Lautner was supposed to be doing it, and a little bit further on, as one of the bad guys is chasing Taylor Lautner, he's got kind of like a predator view where he's where in his view, like information is popping yeah, up in that his eye, cool. and you see the little picture of Taylor Lautner in the bottom. <laughs> but also, then Taylor, the, the character is running through a room where kids are watching TV, and there's a commercial for Stretch Armstrong, the toy. So I guess that's how he, he adopts how his cute. name and stuff like that. <laughs> it's it's really quite good. I was shocked how much I liked it. Now, at some point I'm wondering why is Quicksilver chasing Mr. Fantastic <laughs> through the street? I don't know. So it had a little bit of a Fantastic Four feel there. But yeah. I think suddenly now I've gone from, thank God they killed this stupid looking mm -hmm. movie to, this might have actually been pretty yeah. good. Maybe we will get this at some point. So yeah, Chris Lee, you, uh, you saw the clip that we all just saw. Mm -hmm. Like when you think of a Stretch Armstrong, do you still think something ridiculous? Do you get hope? Like, what what kind of impression did it make on you? That is so not the Stretch Armstrong I remember as a kid. Like, I had the doll, I used to pull it, but he was playing with my Barbies. He was not getting shot by G.I. Joe. So I actually thought it looked really fun, and it is something that I would have seen, and I wouldn't have said that before, so now I'm a little bummed. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to AMC Movie News on YouTube. It's free and a great way to stay updated with all the latest movie news and check out our daily show, AMC Movie Talk. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter to stay in the loop for our special prizes, giveaways, and contests.